All right. Yo, we back. We in finish it. this case. Yeah. The truth. Number 10, the truth. Yeah, fine. I had to burp. All right, we're good. It's weird the music stopped, too. <laughs> All right. All right, so um, it's a new session, so I kind of got to refresh on what we're doing here. So puzzle number 10, the truth. Did my contact speak with you? Oh, yes, I know. He said the same thing to me many times. Don't ever attempt to contact him again. He was risking his life to assist me. This time, he helped you. I beg you, for his sake, never let his cover be blown. Inside the lab, you can see many documents. Since the beginning, your task was to find the secret book. Well, technically, it was to find a confidential document, and that document is inside this room. I promise you the truth, so I will tell you one of the truths. Quote, the author of the book, the first person to walk on the moon, JFK and the Umbrella Man. They are all connected. They were part of a secret research facility working on strange technologies. Many countries were involved in this endeavor. Countless people have been killed to keep the research secret. One of those whose lives were taken was a scientist named Emily. She developed a technology to share dreams. If you get your hands on the book, you can find more about the secrets, the killings, and the shadow government. End quote. The document is disguised as a famous old book. There is a poster on one of the walls that may serve as a clue. Find the name of the book and mail it to me. Each, uh, every document has a hidden tracker that will lead agents directly to your location, except the book you seek. So it is important that you take the book and only that book. I will confirm your answer with my friend. So in the last episode, we emailed his friend. We got the email from the Wingdings. Hey, yeah. <laughs> that was a uh, that was fun. So now we need to find this book. What does that say? So we need problems. Sometimes you need to start from the end. Yeah, we need to get the name of the book. Okay. So problems, sometimes you can start the end. RJ Proz. Uh, let's zoom. Enhance. Enhance. Oh, what is this? What the hell is that? A tribute to the professor of statistics from TCD since 1967. And then what looks like gibberish. Oh, yeah. So that's definitely a code of some sort. What is it? Oh, it's a guy going through mud. Oh, yeah. That's what it looks like. All right. Uh, he has a cross tattoo on him. Yeah. Yeah, mess with this. Maybe zoom back out. Yeah. Just so we can see the whole thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we have documents here. It's hidden as an old book, he said. Yeah. Do so you think it's literally one of those books in the picture? Or would that be mm. too that be too much? A little too cheeky. Yeah. I mean uh, well first things first, we have that code. Yeah, whatever that is. Yeah. What is this? What was the code we used last time? The Caesar cipher. Yeah, that's not gonna help us here, huh? Uh, it might. Do you want me to try it? What? Yeah. What was the Caesar cipher for again? It's like um, uh, putting certain. Le it, I don't like what puzzle was it for. Or how does it work? So what are you? What are you asking? Yeah, like I mean, is that applicable to here? I don't recall I don't what the Caesar cipher was for again. It was just for one of the previous puzzles. Oops. There was another picture with gibberish on it like that, and we had to move the letters around in it. Uh, where's my note? This is my notes, right? Yeah. Uh, okay. All right, it looked like that, and then it just turned into something else. Oh, don't you have to, like, move over everything by, like, two degrees yeah, or something Yeah, yeah, move like each that? letter, like, two down or something like that. Perhaps we should... Wait, problem something? Sometimes you need to start from the end. Oh, Meaning... oh is it just backwards? Yeah. Oh, no, I don't think it's backwards. I think we have to do the code from the... Wait, the check if it's backwards. And not, oh, hold on. Nine, seven. Yeah. Nine, seven, <laughs> eight, eight. All right, hold on. Write, write this down. Yeah, I'm right. I'm getting it. Ready? Yeah. Nine, seven, eight, yep. eight, 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 one, eight, three, four, four, nine, five. Wow, I did that pretty fast. Okay, got it. What does that mean? So read, <laughs> read it back to me. Nine seven eight 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 one eight three four four nine five. Hold on, I'm gonna write it down for my own record here. Okay. okay. Yeah. Nine seven eight 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 eight. eight yep. Four eights. Oh. One eight three four four nine five. Interesting. Okay. Uh, do they correlate to maybe letters on a phone? But I doubt. Why would it be that? Yeah, we haven't gotten like a phone hint. Yeah. And we're looking for a, a book title, right? Keep that in the corner here. Yes, yeah, so we're looking for a book title. Sometimes you need to start from the end, so we got that. Nine, seven, eight, 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 one, eight, three, four, four, 
Nine five. Yeah, so we RJ got Praz. So what what exactly does he want? He wants the name of the book. And it's written by Emily, he said? Did he gave the Find name? Find the Emily. name of the book. Every document has a hidden tracker that will lead agents directly to your location, except the book you seek. So it's important that you take the book and only that book. Um it was taken by a scientist named Emily. My book is still there. Uh hmm, it shares a dreams. Yeah. No, it's got to be more. What are we yeah, missing? The, yeah, there has to be something else. I don't want to just Google, like, no, no, dream numbers. sharing by Emily. Yeah. You know, I... A tribute to the professor of statistics. From TCD? Is that what that says? Look up professor of statistics. TCD. Oh, professor of statistics from TCD 1967. Professor of statistics. In the, in the minute you see uh, the word temporal invasion. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> TCD. 19, what is it? 1967. Guy looks like Earl from Walking Dead, but whatever. The first thing that comes up is Gordon Foster on Wikipedia. Gordon Foster. Tell me about him. Um, he was an Irish computational engineer, st statistician, professor, and college dean. He was widely known for devising in 1965 a nine-digit code. Hey. Which the oh, International yeah, Standard yeah. Book Number is based. Oh, hey. Book number. All right, so. Look that up. I, is this is this nine digits? No, it's way more than nine digits. That's true. Uh, all right. So I guess I'll look up this number, book number. Hmm. Whatever his coding is for book numbers. What was his name? Gordon Foster. Um, he was a professor. Let's see. Do you... 1967. Okay. Huh. What? What do we got? What do you got for me? Well, uh, when I look up, I looked up Gordon Foster book number. Yeah. And books on Amazon come up. It's like Ferns to Know, 9780881922323, and like that. And it's Ooh. like Season for Swans, 9780976. So maybe I can just look yeah, up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look up Gordon, maybe Gordon Foster, and then this number. Yeah. Ooh. We're cracking the code. We're doing it. Just doing it. Feel the Declaration of Independence. <laughs> okay. Nine seven eight 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 one eight three four four nine five nine five. Uh, what? What? You got something? Oh, that hurts. I don't. I don't really know. So I looked it up. Gordon Foster. That number. Yeah. I find Gordon Foster A S R C Federal. And it's like his federal like government thing on the website, okay. but then it's just like missing, and then the number is crossed out. And what? then it's like Gordon Foster profile on Facebook. Then under it's missing, then that number and crossed out. What? Graduation diploma covers missing that number crossed out. <laughs> I don't know, man. <laughs> huh? Yeah, that's really. It's the ISBN number. So hold on, I'll do yeah, I yeah, yeah. ISBN. I'm gonna read over this number. Look up. Here we go. Here we go. Document. The author of the book. Person. The rock net did. Hmm. ISBN book finder. Yes. There you go. Let's do this. Three, four, four, nine, five. Come on. Find book. Oh, I found a book. Oh, you found a book? Yep. All right, lay it on me. Um, it's, well, it's not in English, so I don't really know how to pronounce it, but it's by Leonardo da Vinci. It has, like, the mm -hmm. Zuvian man on the front. I'm going to pronounce it. Ready? Tratato della Petula. <laughs> yep, hey, that's it. That's pasta the one. The description's also not in English, so... Oh, we did it. Oh, we did? I got the achievement before it. Oh, all right. Oh. You have to send that email back to Dr. Quantan. Yeah, it's by, it's by Da Vinci. I sent the name of the book to my friend. He has confirmed it. All right. Hey, good job, David. 
Thanks. As you know, my friend is an important ally. Now that you have the book, he will trust you. As I told you before, the book conceals a hidden document. The document contains some of the details of the secret technologies that the scientists of the shadow government were working on. That shadow government. Including the Common State Memory Processing Module, CSMP, or the Dream Sharing Machine. The Okay. <laughs> Emily was one of the lead researchers in that field. She was found dead under strange circumstances, doubtless the work of the cruel agents of the shadow government. Or she shared her dreams with too many people. <laughs> this document will help us know the truth. Take it and get out of there quickly. All right. Computer for what? <laughs> we did it. We're out, baby. That's the uh, first case done. Yeah, that's case number one. Cool. All huh, right. interesting. Hey, look at that guy. <laughs> what the hell? That's like a real man. I was excited that I was finally accomplishing something with my life. Even Dr. Quantum was impressed with me. Then, Dr. Quantum came to me with some bad news. Uh-oh. View log number two. Whoa, what the hell? Oh, my. Here, you read it. I, I don't even believe what's happening since the last few days. Today is 10th June 2016. <laughs> I had a great week. I was happy to ha have used my intellectual skills to find the secret book. Mandela effect is real. I never experienced such rush before. Such rush. <laughs> this translation. This is what I was born to do. Even Dr. Quantum is impressed with me. Let's find out what's next. Uh-oh. <laughs> Number one, halfway. You're the Mandela halfway. effect, though. Okay. <laughs> well, right. I have some bad news for you. You did get me to the right document, but it is encrypted. They've employed a custom A1667 level crypt, uh, yeah, cryptography, so we cannot decrypt it. We need to find someone who can decrypt it. Thankfully, my friend gave me some in- Oh, new mail? Hello? 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 Oh. About mission from, 2. Oh, from a friend. One. Oh. Oh. Sorry, the information is almost sensitivity, so we cannot say it here directly. Dr. Quantum told you that I would give you something, and that's true. In fact, I already given it to you. Find it. Oh. What? And I, maybe we should finish reading. Maybe. Uh, thank you, my friend has give, uh, gave me some information about the mystery of Emily's murder. He told me there were 12 deaths in total, but only 11 bodies were found. One was still missing. They believe that the last dead person is actually still alive and hidden on some unknown island. They say that the enemy of my enemy is my friend, right? This man was attacked by his own people, so I'm betting that he will help us. Now, you have to do something that they couldn't. You must find him. First, you have to hack into their system to, gain, uh, to access the case file pertaining to the mass murder. You will receive some mail from my old friend. He will give you the instructions. He didn't give us instructions. He just said I gave you something. Or did he? I don't know. About mission 2.1. Friend. 16 March 18. Uh huh. 5.41. A friend. Go back to the picture. A computer for what? <laughs> do you think like this picture is what he sent us i think that's like the gist oh, maybe. Like, he sent us this package case number he keeps reminding me of uh oh my god what's his name i don't know the guy turned blue and big fat liar <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't oh, what's his name I don't Blake, help me out. thank you <laughs> he's a great actor all right uh Case number 45B 68346. It's 88346. Whatever. <laughs> DRI Labs? Yeah. Yeah, A DRI. Labs. 85G Hybrid Brains. Guy from that Frankie dude. Muniz. <laughs> or I mean, you're not from, from Frankie From Muniz. Frankie Muniz. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, the actor. Yeah, yeah, I'm looking for the actor's name. Oh yeah, Paul Giamatti. <laughs> Giamatti. Paul Blart. Paul Blart. Paul Blart. <laughs> anyway, what what do we? Oh my God! Yeah, you guys like big fat liar? <laughs> and he's blue. <laughs> <laughs> Not like I was in any other great movies, uh, like nope. the Truman Show. Nope, that's it. Okay. All right, that that doesn't seem to be doing anything. So what are we looking for? Um, for go back to the color adjustment to that picture. Mess around with it a bit more, and it could there could be nothing. I, oh, it has to do with the codes, obviously, and it has to do with the email that was sent to us by our friend who doesn't fucking give us straight answers. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Let's look back at that email here. Two dot one. Why did he say dot here? I, I don't know. 
In fact, I already have given it to you. Find it. No, just tell us. I know. <laughs> Trying to find a guy who was maybe murdered. What is what is Doctor Quantum asking for exactly? Is he asking? He for just like... wants us to open the case file. He says, hack into other system to gain access to the case file pertaining to the mass murder. You receive some mail from my old friend. He would give you the instructions. Oh. Hmm. How do we like open it? Are there any other tools we can mess with? Um, <laughs> magnifying glass. Oh my lord. <laughs> 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 I just want to put like a Majin symbol on it. That's forehead. the thumbnail. <laughs> uh, okay. D R I. That like this is very specific. It obviously means something, but yeah. Well, I. Eighty five G. Forty five B dot eight eight. What did it mean? I, like, I feel like we don't have enough clues. I, I'm just, like, having trouble, like, figuring out what he's asking Yeah, us. That, that's that's what I'm having trouble figuring out, too. You must find him. First, you have to hack into their system to access the case file pertaining. Oh, so we're hacking into their system. Apparently, that's what we're trying to do, like, but How apparently. do we... With a code? I guess? See, that I just feel like we don't have enough. What? Is that a little help thing? Oh. Let me buy. What does this? Mm. What does his email mean? I'm not sure. Do something that's true. We can't say it directly. So they would give you something that's true. In fact, I already have given it to you. Find it. Are you looking at his previous emails? Yeah. We already used that. Yeah, we did. Can you go to like your computer desktop? Yeah. What do we have going on here? Search things. Yeah, I mean, I guess we... <laughs> no results found for poop. Not found. Damn. They're on to us. <laughs> All right, uh, notes. Photo editor. That's this. Oh, that's this. Maybe it, we haven't. Are you sure there's this nothing? Enough. Yeah, are you sure that there's nothing here? I don't. Oh. <laughs> Fat liar. <laughs> Change the, put it all black and change the contrast. I don't know. That's probably not going to do anything. But You mean light? Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, I don't want to Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. Okay. Oh, man. All right. So, oh, okay. So he said that there were 12 deaths. Oh, yeah. And 11 bodies found. Yeah. Do you think that guy is the other person? Like, literally, that picture of that dude is yeah, the other guy? probably. I believe that. So... <laughs> I thought he had a halo. <laughs> look, he looks like he has a halo. Yeah, it does. He's an angel. He's an angel. Look at him. But, uh... It's a banging goatee. Holy crap. <laughs> Distracted. I, I, I was thinking, oh, maybe if there's a way to, like, search, like, image search that dude I'm, and, like, find his name. Do I don't know either. You can't do that. That can't be it. I know. War on drugs. Oh, scroll up in the. Oh, do the UV thing and look at like the actual letter. Like scroll up. <gasps> How did you fucking know? <laughs> it's just it's guess guess. You fucking. <laughs> He's played this before. Yeah, you fucking <laughs> Go to. I just thought we because we computer. looked at the picture but not the letter. Open tools, search, and what does it say? Search, search and listen? No. No. Search and... L -l -l install. Oh, install. Oh, God. What is that? Write this down. All right, yeah. Q. Q. Dash. Dash. Capital... Oh, it's a capital Q. Well. Yep. Capital C. Yep. L. L. J. I think it's an, is that a J or an R? Oh, no, it's an H. Sorry, C-H. Oh. 
C H. Okay. G. Lowercase. G. T. Yeah, T. T. The number two seven two. Two seven two eight. Zero one three. Zero one three. Okay. Boom. Boom. Good thing genius. I played You're puzzle a games, boys. You're a genius. <laughs> right, lay it on me. Uh, capital Q. Yeah. Dash capital C. H. G. T. Two seven two. Eight zero one three. Really? Maybe I read it wrong. How long? So That's go a Q, up. right? That totally is a Q. Does it mean search for that or search for something else? It says search and... Open okay. tools, search and install. Yeah. Okay, yeah. I mean... So Q uh, dash oh, yeah, that's not a G, that's an A. Uh, Look at the A in and. Search and install. The, oh, you're right. It's the same. Okay. I wonder if it saved it. Hey, it did. It did. So it's an A. Wait, did you put S A? Oh. oh, it's chat. Q chat. Oh yeah. Oh. A secure end-to-end right. -end encrypted chat. Cool. It is powered by quantum entanglement. What the hell? <laughs> sure, why hey, not? Hey, we got a T Rex. Hey, baby. <laughs> All right. Send hey, it's me, the friend. Oh, I can't. I can't write send nudes. Uh. Tetron is a part of the team. One five two seven nine is my ID. Please confirm that you're getting my messages. Reply ASAP. Okay. Got your messages. What do we have planned? And you respond, replied. please. Yeah. Res respond, please, okay. friend. Oh, first, you need to confirm your status with Dr. Quantum. Send this phrase below to Dr. Quantum. Make sure that you send it as a solution of mission 2.1. The phrase is, I am leaving this mission. What? Okay, I'm on it. <laughs> I feel like that's... The way to continue the mission is to say, I'm leaving the mission. Okay, and please use this channel only when it's necessary. I'll be in touch with you later. Okay, can we talk now? <laughs> I'm no, lonely. I said only when necessary. This channel's deactivated. <laughs> can we talk more? Is this is this gonna be a loop? Is this gonna... <laughs> Are you there? <laughs> oh. Oh, he left. He left. All right, so he, he said to, oh, <laughs> he said to make sure it's a response to yeah puzzle so, two dot one yeah so I have to send answer oh yeah okay I I I am leaving the message what is I, it I think it was it just I'm right I don't remember <laughs> let's <laughs> oh god we're the worst. Scroll up. Crap. <laughs> Crap. I am, I am leaving, leaving this, this mission. mission. Did I say that? I think that's what you said. <laughs> hey. Okay, wait, hold on. Their status is now confirmed. Keep moving. All right. We did it. Oh, okay. So we're done with this? Yeah, complete it. Yeah. Hey, that's completed for this episode, baby. Yeah, it is. We're done. I feel, I feel accomplished. Yeah, we got one case file done. We started this one. Yeah. We're closer to wherever Slender Man is. <laughs> He's here, don't worry. Wherever JFK <laughs> is hiding them. Let's go. Next episode.